La ciudad de Veracruz es antigua. Veracruz tiene muchos lugares históricos. Es una de las ciudades más antiguas de México. Hernán Cortés es un Veracruz. Tienen un famoso carnaval de canto y ballet. Una de las iglesias está dedica a la femenina. Veracruz es una de las ciudades con más historia. Jaroca Veracruz, which is also known as Veracruz, became a city in 1615 and then it became a state in 1824. It's one of the country's oldest and largest cities founded in the 16th century by Spanish settlers. It is also known as one of the third most indigenous states of Mexico. Hernan Cortez founded the city while looking for gold in 1519. It is known for its beaches, carnival, music, and dance. Veracruz is built down on a hot, sandy beach, which is along the Gulf of Mexico. It is about 50 feet above sea level, and it was relocated twice because of its dangerous flooding and not enough fresh water. One of the many things Veracruz is known for is its colonial area buildings, indigenous cultural influences, and regional cuisine. There is a huge commercial fishing port which offers sport fishing, beaches, and water sports. Since Veracruz has so many nice beaches, it offers many fun outdoor activities to do. Some surfers that are experienced drive many miles just to surf in Veracruz. Hernan Cortez landed there by being driven off the Yucatan coast by the Maya. He was trying to set sail from Mexico against the express orders of his superior, which was the governor of Cuba. There were two native ethnic groups that had met him. He then exploited his inner ethnic rivalries in order to show his own strength. Then he was conquered by the Aztecs. He eventually had a whole series of ethnic groups and turned them into allies. Veracruz has one of the most leading economies. It has one-fourth of Mexico's petroleum reserves and many refineries. It is also leading in agricultural products like coffee, vanilla, sugarcane, and many more. They mostly depend on corn and beans. They also are one of the leading producers of beef cattle. Nine days before Ash Wednesday, Veracruz hosts a famous carnival. It is a time of spiritual fasting, singing, and dancing. They also host the Afro-Caribbean festival where other countries like Cuba, Jamaica, and Colombia come over to dance. They listen to music, film, and do art. One of the most popular museums in Veracruz is the Museo de Antropologia de Exabla. This building was designed by the architect Paul Balik. It was opened in 1987. This museum offers many educational services. It even promotes development of creative skills. Some main attractions are the giant Olmec's head and the museum that were discovered by an archaeological site in Textepec, Veracruz. One of the churches is the Veracruz Cathedral. It is dedicated to the Lady of Assumption and it is located in the historic center of Veracruz. It was consecrated as a cathedral in 1963. It had been built in the early 17th century and is still there, but it didn't start as a cathedral, it was a parish. Then they had expanded it to its new neoclassical style. It had been burnt down because of the church candles and that is why they had expanded and rebuilt the church.